Hello guys, welcome to Amit Things. In this video, we will see how we can easily download and install the current NetBeans version. So to install NetBeans, we need Java. Step one would be to download and install Java, then we will install NetBeans. So let us begin with the step one that is to install the current Java version. Let's start. At first, go to the web browser. I am using Chrome, you can use any web browser. Now here in just type Oracle Java on Google. Press enter. On pressing enter, the official website is visible that is oracle.com. Click on it. On typing this, it will directly take you to the following oracle.com slash java. Directly click on, click on download java. Here it is, the downloads are visible. Go below. You can see java 19 is visible. This is what we want, JDK 19. Okay. The current version is 19.0.1 and now you don't need JRE, remember. JDK comes with JRE, so you only need to install JDK to install Java. So versions for Linux, Mac and Windows, we want for Windows. And the installer here it is, for Windows x64, 158MB, exe file visible here. Click on it to download. Download started only 159MB, let's wait for few seconds. So guys, we have successfully downloaded the current Java version, here is the exe file. Double click on it to install. Minimize. Now the setup will start. Here it is. JDK Java 19.0.1. Click on next. Now herein you can see the destination folder wherein our Java will get installed. It will get saved under program files. You can change the location but keep it as default and click on next. The download completed, click on close. Now what we can do guys, we will go to the location where we installed it so that we can set the path. It was in C drive if you remember, program files. And herein it was under Java, here it is. Click on it, JDK 19 and this is where our Java got installed. Click on the bin and just right click and copy this path. Copy, now minimize and let's go to start type environment variables click on edit the system environment variables here it is click on open now under system properties advanced tab click on environment variables here and you can see the system variables are visible under environment variables go here look for path here is the path ok what we need to do we need to go to this path and double click now after double clicking click on new and uh, right click and paste the same path. Here it is. That is the bin path. Java JDK 19 bin path. Click on OK. OK and the last OK. That's it. We successfully installed Java. Now let's verify. Go to start. Type CMD and open the command prompt. Here it is. Click on open to open it. We have opened it. Here in just type Java space hyphen hyphen version and press enter. The same command. Here you can see Java 19.0.1 that is we successfully installed the current Java version. So guys we successfully installed the current Java version. Let us now go to the web browser and download and install NetBeans. Here in type NetBeans. Press enter. On pressing enter the official website is visible that is apache.netbeans. That is apache NetBeans. NetBeans is owned by Apache. Click on it. On clicking, you can see the current version is visible, Apache NetBeans 16. Click on download. If you are unable to find it, you can also click on download here. I will click on download directly from this website. Now you can see the NetBeans 16 is visible. From here in we can download it. Different versions are visible for Windows, Mac and Linux. We want for Windows. So I will directly click on the following exe file to download it. Now the mirror is visible. We suggest the following site for your download. Click on it to download it. Now download started 437 MB. Let's wait for a few seconds. So guys, we have successfully downloaded the exe file for NetBeans. Double click on it to install. Minimize this. It is configuring the installer. 
and here it is it will install the following installation file is 801.9 MB you can customize also to see what we are installing customize here it is it will install all of them you can also use it for Java or web dev that is HTML PHP let us keep it as it is if you want for Java only you can go for the first three click on OK next I accept it yes click on next again now here it is guys it will install the Apache NetBeans to the following folder under program files and this is the JDK that is Java I told you for NetBeans we need Java so it automatically took the same path wherein we installed our JDK that is you can see 19.0.1 was installed in the following location if you remember okay that's it keep it as it is you don't need to change anything click on next yes keep it as it is check for updates fine click on install now it will install So guys we have successfully installed the NetBeans click on finish and you can see the shortcut is also visible you can directly click on open here or you can go to start and type NetBeans here it is you can also click on open here so let me click the shortcut and open NetBeans for the first time here it is guys we have started this so I'll just click on close here go to file and let us create a new Java project quickly click on new project here it is Java so here in you can see we want a sample project so I'll go for Java with Maven and just go for the easiest application that is Java application here click on next it will activate it since this is your first Java project on NetBeans Here and you can see we need to add the name on location let's say I'll add Amit application to our project that's it you can add any name the location is the following you can also change the location from here but I'll keep it as it is package let's say I'll change it to my my own website studiopedia and that's it Amit application click on finish this will create our first Java project on NetBeans Here it is guys our first project here it is package we added if you remember com.studiopedia.amit application and here is our class name amit application because our file name was amit application.java these two should be same else there will be an error and the following public static word main and we have our system.out.println this line will print whatever you will add in between that is it will print hello world right now I will just uh, remove it and type my first java program that's it and that's it and I'll just click on file and save all here it is now to run it you can just click on here this is the run project button or you can press F6 I just pressed it here and you can see build success because we successfully printed it okay here it is here it is my first Java program and this is what we printed so guys in this video we saw how we can easily download and install the current NetBeans on Windows thank you for watching the video